Welcome to The Witcher 3. Today we are going to learn two different ways to use potions as well as how to replenish them. Now the first way we're going to look at involves inventory. So what we're going to do is we are going to hit the pause button. It's right above the right analog stick. Now that we have that up, we are going to go to inventory. It should be one to the left. And we'll press A there. Now we're just looking for potions. I'm going to circle it and make a big box so you can see what it looks like. Use the left analog stick or the control pad to get there. And basically, there's a bunch of different potions. And to use a potion, we are simply going to press X to consume it. Now let's shift our attention to equipping them for use in combat or just walking around what we're going to do is we are going to press a on the specific potion we want go ahead and select that one there and then we'll have four different choices we'll add it to that category right there i'm going to go ahead and equip all of these as potions and then i'm going to show you another little trick involving how to cycle through and how to use them on uh, the fly. Let's get that uh, last one here, replacing the bread. Press A there, and we got the bread replaced. Now let's go ahead and back out. Okay, now we can walk through how to use them quickly. What we're gonna do is hold down L1, and you'll notice there's a bunch of different options. We'll zoom in on that. Basically, if you wanna switch, one of the two potions up top, simply hold the control pad up and it'll go ahead and swap. You can do the same on the bottom and two. And of course to consume, all you need to do is press the control pad either up or down and it will consume uh, the potion just like we did there and we consume again. And uh, that's pretty much it for that. One important thing to keep in mind when choosing potions and that is there's a toxicity limit of 100%. So typically uh, you can only use two potions unless you were going to use some potions that had a lower toxicity percentage. And of course there is another way to remove the toxicity and replenish all the potions. And that involves meditation which can be found by pausing and going to meditation. And then what you want to do is set the clock to a certain amount of time and press A and then it automatically replenishes all the potions however it does make any effects that the character has in place go away so something to keep in mind there and that's going to wrap it up for more tips be sure to click on the link in the description below thanks for watching